painting windows, huh? One of my least favorite tasks. I mean, it's just kind of a nightmare, right? You've got all these tiny little mutton bars right here. The paint always ends up getting on the glass. You could spend hours doing just one window. Hours of pain in the neck. Of course, um, if you've got a steady hand, like a pro, it's not that exactly. bad. Exactly. You could, there's two ways of the way. You could go with the, you know, a small brush, cutting around the glass pieces. Mm -hmm. Or you could blue tape everything, masking, which it takes a lot of time. And you don't want to go that way. It's not always that effective, right? I mean, look at this. We've got we've got six panes here. If this was a double hung window, you'd have twelve in total. You could spend forever masking around, and sometimes the paint drips underneath the tape. It's not easy. And the paint goes right under the tape. It, it's yeah. not a good thing. And so, what um, is this that you've got on here? This is is a lick, a masking liquid. It's a product that I've been using for a while. Works really good. Fantastic. All right. Let's see it. What what's the process? It's like this goes right whoa, against whoa, whoa. the you're edge. painting the glass exactly I'm not painting the glass I'm just protecting the glass okay so it goes on white and dries out least out clear but you're also getting a little bit here on the uh, the mutton right there you're not worried about that no problem because this product works really great as a spot primer when it's time to top coat no problem with this um, clear coat on. So this can become a spot primer for the small spaces right here. Exactly. Wow. All right. Kevin, now I'm done with my first coat. We're going to wait about 30 minutes for this to dry, mm -hmm. and we'll be ready for the second coat. After the second coat's done, we have to wait about four hours to cure it. Okay. And then we're ready to top coat. And is that what we've got here, two coats fully cured? Exactly. This is what we got here. We got this three pans done. Yep. It's cured. It's ready to top coat now. Let's do it. I'm going to start by this top. Mm -hmm. I'm not worried about if I get some paint on this glass because it's already protected with the mask and liquid. Well, that is the magic right there, huh? When the time is to peel off, it all comes up. So this is where you just sort of quickly fly through it because you don't have to worry about the glass. Exactly. This is why you're saving a lot of time right here. Well, Kevin, paint is dry. Now I'm going to get my razor knife mm -hmm. and I'm going to cut around the edges and peel this right off. So this is the score between the uh, mutton and the glass. Exactly. Nice and easy. Okay, now it's time to peel this off. Make one little section. Oh my goodness. Take a look at it. Nice look and easy. at that. See it? Nice clean lines. Like a piece of plastic wrap. A piece of plastic right there. That is remarkable. Now and look, look at, at the line you've got. Straight lines, no paint on glass, beautiful. Nothing on the glass. Nothing. So two coats of the masking liquid and a top coat, and it's still faster than if you were to do it by hand. You can save, I still save a lot of time. Remarkable, Mauro. Thank you. Mm -hmm.